Hey guys, welcome back to Trusted Technology. Today we'll talk about how to invest in quantum computing. Let's head into it. Investing in quantum computing. Over the last several years, quantum computer technology has made significant advancements and is becoming increasingly economical to create and manufacture. That's excellent news because the need for increasingly powerful processing units is increasing as cloud computing grows in popularity and digital gadgets become more widely available. Quantum computing has the potential to become a major technology and investment trend in the next decades. Nonetheless, Less, given this sector is still in its infancy, a quantum computing exchange traded fund may be the most advantageous option to invest in. Using superposition, which is a phenomenon that happens at the subatomic scale when particles have no clearly defined state, quantum computers are able to do calculations. Utilizing the power of superposition to substantially increase processing speed can aid in the solution of complicated issues in the real world, such as logistics, coordination, or the simulation of pharmaceutical structure. The introduction of cloud computing has aided in the expansion of access to quantum computers as computations are sent to researchers via a network link. Also make sure to write your thoughts in the comment section. Where to invest? Because quantum computing is still in its early stages of development, there are only a few firms dedicated completely to the technology. Some well-known firms are funneling significant research money into quantum computing. As is a freshly public pure play in the quantum domain, as well as a couple other pure plays in the quantum realm that are shortly to be publicly traded. The following are the finest quantum computing stocks. Microsoft is a software giant with a number of research laboratories dedicated to quantum computing. The company also provides quantum computing services via the cloud, mostly through Azure. A new corporation centered on the emerging sector is being created by Honeywell. It was recently revealed that quantum processor creator Rigetti Computing would be brought public through a merger with the SPAC Supernova. A partner's acquisition company. This is another quantum startup, defines quantum ETF. Additionally, there is one ETF dedicated to the quantum computing industry that defines quantum ETF. Earlier this year, defines ETFs, the business that sponsors this and other themed ETFs, launched with the Quantum ETF making its debut in September of that year. The Defines Quantum ETF comprises of 70 different equities, the majority of which are semiconductor and software businesses that are involved in or have exposure to quantum computing in some way. Despite the fund's tiny size, it has a significant amount of net assets under administration, with $172 million in total. Expenses are 0.40% of assets under management, which equates to $40 in yearly fees for every $1,000 in assets under management. Conclusion. The following are some of the advantages of the Defines Quantum ETF. Preventing broad commercialization of quantum computing by gaining a well-diversified exposure to the sector because the ETF invests in proven semiconductor and software technology businesses that are not primarily dependent on the development of quantum computing. The fund's performance should be more stable over time. Within a short period of time, the value of the Defines Quantum ETF has more than doubled, albeit this is primarily due to the development in the technology industry as a whole rather than to quantum computing particularly. Despite the fact that there is just one quantum computing exchange traded fund available at the present, there are additional options for investors interested in betting on the technology. INQ is the world's first publicly listed pure play stock in quantum technology with a market cap of $1 billion. In a similar vein, at present moment, INQ, Rigetti Computing, and Honeywell are not included in the Defines Quantum ETF's basket of companies. It's worthwhile to explore the Defines Quantum ETF if you're seeking for a reasonable method to gain from an advancement of quantum computing while also reducing your risk. Despite the fact that it's well diversified among dozens of technology businesses, it will not implode if quantum computing doesn't take off, as most of these companies rely on other technological trends, such as artificial intelligence and machine learning. It's a terrific place to start if you want to get in on quantum computing when it's still in its early stages. What do you think about quantum computers? Would you invest in them? Let us know in the comment section. This brings us to the end of our video. I hope you enjoyed it. Hit like if you did, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel so that you don't miss any of our videos in the future. Also, watch the two videos that are on your screen because I'm sure you'll love them. With that, I'll see you in the next video.